hello guys i'm back again welcome to our channel and at this moment i want to do a follow-up video on the one i did previously for farm yield token how to purchase it using pancake swap and trust wallet today or right now because i'm still recording this video the same day i'm coming to show you how to buy the same token called farm yield token using coin market cap and metamask okay now before we come to the buying process we need to look at some few things with metamask okay so first of all if you don't have metamask installed in your browser okay if you don't have the metamask extension installed in your browser then go to google and search for metamask okay search for metamask All right now once you search for metamask come down here to where we have metamask.io metamask.io and click on it All right now if you are a crypto trader and you really want to protect your wallet uh, wallets that are extensions on browsers then i advise you to download the brave browser okay use the brave browser because of its uh security level i prefer you using the brave browser for your wallet extensions than the chrome and other browsers that we have out there all right guys so once you come to uh, metamask.io click on download now and then it will bring you to this session where they say install metamask for brave i'm using the brave browser so if you don't have it please download it and make sure that you install the extension in order to be able to follow this tutorial till the end all right guys because i've already installed it i'm not going to go through the entire process again so once you click on install it will automatically install the metamask extension and when you come to the top here you can find your metamask uh, extension over there you can click on it and it will open up and then we continue from there so now once you finish installation and everything the default mainnet of metamask is the ethereum mainnet okay there are other uh, networks if you click over here, you can see other chains we have the test nets of other uh, chains over here but in this particular lesson we want this binance smart chain network to be able to purchase farm yield token so we need to add the binance chain network to our metamask so though it is not here by default we can add it manually okay now how do we do that so i'm going to take you step by step through the process of adding it to your metamask okay so the first thing you are going to do is to come to the top here where my mouse is close to the ethereum main network the logo over there you click on it then you come to settings okay you click on settings then you will see here where we have settings at the left section here where my mouse is currently you see networks click on it and then you go to the top here where they say add networks you click on add networks once you do that it will pop up this information for you okay then where they say network name type smart chain okay guys just use the information as i'll be giving to you over here okay then where they say what where they said um sorry guys just a minute i want to copy the url all right so where they say new rpc url we paste this there so i'll leave this uh link in the description of the video okay so you can get access to 
the link and other info necessary information in the description of the video then when they say chain id type 56 enter 56 where they say currency symbol enter bnb because that is the symbol of smart chain and where they say blog explorer i'll leave the link as well in the description of this video so you can just copy and paste it into this session over here all right guys okay so once you filled all the information correctly click on save okay so you click on the save button here and once you do that as you can see you can see that our bnb or our smart chain network has been automatically added to our trust what and um, sorry to our metamask okay so now we can easily purchase our farm yield token with our bnb okay guys we can easily purchase farm yield token with our bnb so we are going to get right into that now so we are going back now that we have gotten our uh, smart chain network connected to our metamask and we have already bought our bmd smart chain we are now ready to purchase our farm yield token so guys let's go back to coin market cap so here in coin market cap what you need to do is to just go to the search bar over here and then you type farming f a r m y once you type farm you will see the farm yield token pop up click on it and once you click on it you can see all information you need about the project you can click here and it will take you to their website okay their official website let me be specific their official website the reason why i'm stressing this is a lot of you don't know how to uh, check for these things and then you end up being scam let's go back to coin market cap so right here on coin market cap you can as well join their telegram page when you come to where they say chat if you hover your mouse you see the drop down you can click on this two telegram uh page link one will take you to the chat group one will take you to the announcement page okay guys so once you click on it straight to their official official telegram page where you can get all information from now this is the contract address that we'll be copying and using it to add the farm yield token to our metamax uh wallet all right now if you want to see the total uh supply you can come down here and you can see the maximum supply of the farm yield token and also you can see the all-time low and the all-time high of the token all right now let's come to the main uh the main topic for this video which is how to purchase your farm yield token so to do that come to the right bottom corner here where the the road swap farming okay click on it so we are buying from pancake using uh metamax so automatically you see that once you click on that you see that metamax is automatically open so all you do here is to click on i understand and then you click on import once you are done with that click on unlock wallet or connect okay so once you do that you click on metamax okay so already it, it opened up first time so all you need to do is to come to the top here where the metamax icon is then you click on it wait for it so already this the um permission or the request so all you need to do is already selected you click on next then you check this uh box over here okay it's already checked so you just click on connect so you wait patiently so as you can see it is now connected so you can now go back to your 
your coin market cap and you can see that your bnb balance is showing there and then all you need to do is to do or to select the bnb and then the fami token then you swap from bnb to the fami token to do that you see that the fami is the one on top so because we are buy, we are going to buy fami token we are going to do what we are going to move it by clicking on this arrow pointing downward here you click on it then that rather come down then when they say busd you click there and you select bnb but if you have a busd uh, balance if you have some uh, money in your busd and you want to use that you can select busd and you use that to do your purchase but in this video i'm having bnb i don't have busd so i'm going to use my bnb token to swap for my farming token now i want to use all my bnb so all i'm going to do is i click on max and it will automatically determine the amount i can buy depending on the fee they are going to charge now for the price impact if it is more than nine percent then it means maybe the total amount of token you are going to buy is too high so you need to buy it in bits so always it should be below nine percent okay and the price should be one percent two percent okay then also where the, we have the settings button here you can come there and change the spillage if you think the spillage is too high for you or too low for you you can change it but i'll leave it at 0 0.5 because it works for me okay guys so now that we have entered our value the amount we want to uh, we want to buy and uh, what i'm going to we are going to do now is to click on the swap button okay so you click on the swap button here and then you confirm the swap so we wait patiently for the transaction to confirm so metamax will note so here you can see the fee that you are being charged all you need to do is to click on confirm so once you confirm it the transaction will pick up over here you click on close and then you wait patiently for your farming balance to, what, to update so they say transaction confirmed and you can view that on the uh binance scan okay bsc scan so here you can see that your um how do we call it your family balance have what have changed so we have 200 and odd 11 farm yield token purchased using when market cap swap uh function from pancake swap okay so this is how easy it is to be able to use your uh metamax and laptop to purchase farm yield token guys this is one of the best projects in 2021 that is going to be doing massively well as i said it is currently on a pullback this is the best time to accumulate more token and if you are new to the token this is the best time to jump in before the next impulsive movement begins all right guys before um we go let me quickly show you how you can add you can add your uh, farm yield token to your metamax okay so you copy the contract address over here then you come to your metamask come to the section where they say import tokens so you click on import tokens then where they say token address you paste your contract address there and it will automatically fill in the details of the uh, farm yield token for you all you need to do is to click on add custom token and you can see your farm yield token and its balance in your wallet once you see that click on import token and that is all guys thank you thank you for watching if you are new to our channel once again hit the subscribe button press the bell notification button to stay notified that time we release a new video also like and share this video with your friends so that they can also join the farm yield family
So I come your way again with another video. It is bye for now. <laughs>